Welcome everyone. In today's discussion, we are venturing into the future of routing landscape, which is poised for some significant shifts in the coming years. The challenge of meeting customer demands is an endless one for service providers, cloud providers, and large enterprises alike. And what is driving this change? Let's dive into some of the trends we are seeing. We have cloud and edge workloads pushing the boundaries, demanding more from metro networks, data center interconnects, and data center edges. And let's not forget AI workloads. They are redefining the scale in data center networks, sparking unprecedented traffic growth. In the midst of all this, there is a clear demand for 800 gig routing solutions. Why? Because they are the key to scaling up capacity and bringing down latency and transforming networks into a next generation revenue engine. Here with me today is AE to dive into some of the exciting updates and insights. AE, it's great to have you today, especially as we are at the brink of something truly game changing in the routing world. Juniper has been making waves with recent launch of the first ever AI native platform. Not to mention rolling out impressive 800 gig solution aimed at revolutionizing the AI DC networking. Could you break down what an AI native platform really is and share why AI networking solutions have become so crucial at this moment? Uh, thank you, Julius, for having me. Um, it's really interesting when we talk about AI native. It is the epicenter of building the user experience that we talk about and experience first networking. The fundamentals that we need to start with AI native is to have the right data, to produce and analyze the data to produce the right inferences, and provide the right responses to the user so that it becomes a lot more automatic and automated for them to be able to use this and have that level of experience that we need. Let's talk a little bit what it actually means to the networking and the networking workloads. AI, as it is, has to do two things. First, it has to learn with building models, and it has to actually munch humongous amounts of data, compute, storage, and all of that stuff. That is driving a huge demand, not just in data centers, but also in the networking, and it's causing us to actually build larger data centers with tens of thousands of GPUs clustered together to perform both training of AI models and learning of AI models. That is causing us to build larger and larger pipes that makes us build bigger networks with huge latency. And it comes with a whole bunch of challenges as we embark on this journey. And we have some exciting technology here at Juniper to actually build on top of it in a cost-effective way and to drive the fundamentals of sustainability, performance, and automation that we've always talked about. Awesome, awesome, fantastic. Uh, the launch truly makes a significant milestone for the industry and Juniper. And it's thrilling to witness Juniper's crucial role in revolutionizing the AI networking. So, but now, focusing on the 800 gig launch, what are we introducing to the market at this moment? And why is it absolutely critical for our customers? Most importantly, our service providers and cloud customers. Very interesting. So we just announced the 800 gig data center enabler platforms. It's not just in the data center like you talked about. It is clustering these data centers together, the data center interconnects, the peering points, the edge routing, the edge compute, the inferencing agents that you need, and all of the above is driving the network to actually grow in terms of bandwidth, throughput, and demands that we're doing. So we have embarked on building 800 gig platforms on our PTX to provide our users with that capability and scalability both in terms of our PTX 10002, which is a fixed form factor, gives you about 36 of the 800 gig ports in one unified platform, and also line cards for our existing PTX platforms that you had the wonderful 400 gig to migrate over to 800 gig seamlessly and increase your capacity. We're doing this all with the same principles that we talked about, because the challenges as you go up 
is how do you make it power efficient? How do you make it space efficient? And how do you make it sustainable? How do you make the performance really, really scale up and build out for the networks that they have? And on top of it, this is the AI world. It is AI in the data center and networking for AI. We have to build automation that actually provides all of these capabilities to drive what we've been constantly talking about is experience-first networking. The users really experience the marvelous usage of all of this technology to ease their workloads and to do their day-to-day -day jobs. Thanks for shedding light on how Juniper is pushing the boundaries with its 800 gig solution, extending beyond AI networking and bringing broader routing use cases. Sustainability being a major focus for many operators, aiming to achieve their green goals while also managing operational costs. Could you share how we are setting pace in the sustainability arena? Very interesting. Uh, every time I have a conversation with customers, uh, Julius, sustainability is on top of their minds. You know, people can cool their current data centers, but once you embark with larger GPUs and 800 gig and everything else, they need to be able to provide the power and the capacity and be able to actually cool and maintain their data center. It's a challenge. So what we do is we start with sustainable silicon. When we design our silicon and architect our silicon, we make sure that it has huge improvements in power and sustainability. We are 49% improved on watts per gigabit. Next, it just not stands out with, uh, with silicon. It has to be built into the systems, how we actually operate the systems, what capabilities do we provide, and how we actually make that really, really work. And this is capabilities for us to be able to shut down when something is not uh, used, to bring it up very quickly and easily, to manage it, to provide telemetry, and last but not the least, once you build these systems, they get deployed by our customers. And when they use it, how do you actually help them use it in a sustainable manner so that they can actually have TCO savings of 25 to 30% when they deploy our solutions? This is important for us, and we drive this meticulously through all the three factors of silicon systems and the operational capability. And the operational capability is as important as the rest of it. That's great, AE. Let's get to performance. Our customers understand that performance is in our DNA. Why do you believe Juniper is uniquely positioned to revolutionize 800 gig networking, especially in regards to our proven performance? Uh, thank you, Julius. I mean, uh, it's good to stand uh, with the Juniper brand, right? We were the first to deliver 10 gig and 40 gig, and now we would be the first to deliver 800 gig platforms to this industry because we believe in driving that performance without a single compromise in anything and everything that we do. And we've been leading uh, in our deployments with 400 gig capabilities through the WAN deployments of several customers, lots of wins, and they are excited to actually use our 400 gig, and they are really, really looking forward to our 800 gig solutions as we embark on this journey here. We want to provide 800 gig with full capacity, maximum density that you can actually fit in any form factor. Our fixed form factor will give you 36 ports of 800 gig in one shot. It's amazing to see that kind of a density. We provide line rate MaxSec at 800 gig. It's amazing for what we can actually do that. All of this with embedded reliability, security, and completeness in terms of what it is. Not only that, we deliver our Juno software, which has the highest scale in our control plane and admin plane that really enable our users to meet their relentless demands and the scaling demands that they've always seen. That is important for us as we build our solutions. Could you elaborate on how these advancements, especially in automation, are poised to help network operators, especially to differentiate themselves in this experience-first networking? The third key pillar, we talked about sustainability performance, and now let's talk about automation because this is important. The reason why automation is important is because the networks and everything else is getting more and more complex. We cannot have human beings literally operate on it like how we used to do before. So automation is a key to building all of this. And the crux of building this automation comes 
from making sure our software and our systems actually deliver the data that is important for people to actually build on top of that telemetry and learn from it. Remember the right data. So producing the right data, giving people the models, and once you have the models that can learn, it provides the right inferences and gives you the right responses. While you do all of these things, these models help you automate so that you can take the complexity of running these complex networks and the SLAs that these networks have to meet for their applications. Every application is going to ask for throughput, jitter, latency, and demands that are unprecedented from before. And AI and AI clusters are demanding even more for the user to have that true user experience that we talk about. This has to perform at that level. And that is why automation with a single easy button to remove the complexity and to make it easy for, the, uh, for our users to operate their network is important. Not only that, security is a key for us to build this and build the solution. So we actually have built security right from how we securely bring up the system with TPM 2.0 and also provide MaxSec capabilities at line rate, provide all of the security aspects built into our automation toolkit called Paragon. And that is going to give you the capabilities to easily integrate it with your operations. And the customers just love it. Thanks, A. It's clear that Juniper's Paragon is revolutionizing the game by delivering not just a superior operational experience, but also top-notch end-user experience securely. It has been enlightening to dive into Juniper's 800 vision and the solutions, and to understand why Juniper stands as a trusted partner in this thrilling journey of transformation. Before we conclude, do you have any final thoughts you would like to share? Absolutely, Julius. Um, it, is, it is interesting because our 400 gig is deployed worldwide in every large service provider and hyperscaler that we could think of and others. It has helped people build large scale networks and the unprecedented demand, right? We have content delivery networks where people are seeing demands of 40% increase year over year, and they are able to actually match that with our 400 gig solutions. And they were able to meet that demand immediately. When we talk to them with our 800 gig solutions, they are extremely excited about the 800 gig solutions that we are bringing to this market, and they want to actually deploy them. It is all over the place with all of the use cases that you can think of, whether it is large scale service providers, whether it is hyperscalers, whether it is other cloud providers, or even large scale enterprises and enterprise routing is looking at it with the huge demands that AI and AI clusters and all of the other things that is coming into the network today. I can just give you a tip. We turned on orderability of our 800 gig platforms. We're starting to see orders. Every week when I talk to my product managers, they're saying, we have just doubled the number of customers who want to trial and beta our 800 gig. Every week it's doubling. That is the kind of demand and that is the kind of what excitement that we're bringing to this market with our 800 gig. Thanks, A.E., for exciting updates and insights. As we wrap up, let's acknowledge that major service providers, cloud providers, and enterprises are all in a heated race towards adopting the next level of scale and efficiencies. Our commitment ensures that innovations like our 800 gigi solution stay at the forefront of sustainability, performance, and automation. As we step into the exciting new era, our goal remains steadfast, to deliver networking solutions that not only rise to meet today's challenges, but also set new benchmarks for what's possible in the future. Thank you, AE. Thank, Thank you. you all.